snowbird is doing great. He had that one little place where you had to kind of hop around a little bit. Came through it fine. Then he had trouble getting over those logs over there. He could go to his right and get over them pretty easy, but going around to the, his left and going over them, that was a little more difficult for him. But he made it. No, no, we're not quite an hour. We're probably close to an hour into it. Now it's time to check out this rope around him and maybe around his leg some. All this is just great preparation for that first ride. And of course the objective is to make it as uneventful as possible. But uh, you gotta just love this little guy. See, he just really wants to be good. See, he's opening it up to Buddy's right, and he's following his field. There's nice floating on lead rope. Got a little tight there. He's going to raise the price of poker a little bit and get his feet to move. You don't want to be sneaking around these coals. Because you don't want to be driving them and harassing them either. But they got to move. It's time to do some pre pre ride prep. That's the first time he handled that pretty darn good, actually. This is looking real good. We're still not quite an hour into it yet. He really wants to hang out with Buddy, see? He's developing a lot of confidence in this little guy and trust too. It's like the old saying, it, it takes a long time to build trust, 10 seconds to lose it. Now he's got his head turned to the left a little bit, and now he's moving the stirrups. The little guy's handling this all pretty darn good. Now it's a good time to work with the head again, get that where he kind of mentally turns loose more and physically turns loose a little more. He's bringing that head around to the left and down kind of low when he needs to. Now we'll just turn him loose and, and he can, there's nothing he can do wrong here. He might have to buck and play when those stirrups jump and hit him on the side. This is real good. We'll stop it and restart it.